Good Tuesday, everyone. This is meteorologist Dave Snyder at the National Weather Service with Alaska statewide weather. Snow and blowing snow occurring across the North Slope today with snow falling across the Brooks Range on the north and the south side. We'll continue to see snow falling at least through tonight and tomorrow. And as a result of that, winter storm warnings are posted for many areas across the North Slope as we go through the remainder of the day. So going to tonight, do expect to see uh, snow continuing across the region as much as four to eight inches of snow across some of the uh, Brooks Range, especially the eastern Brooks Range there and the south-facing slopes uh, where areas along the Dalton Highway could be looking at a good four to eight inches. Some localized amounts just to the east and south, maybe as much as 12. Significant reductions in visibility will be a part of the problem. As we go through the rest of the day, we're also looking at some stronger winds across the Alaska Range. Watch for that to continue across uh, the uh, eastern Alaska Range as well as the Denali region where wind advisors are in effect through the remainder of today and into tonight. Some gusts there up to 60 miles per hour should be expected at least through midnight. The winds will settle down a little bit more as we head into tomorrow. I do expect to see uh, some heavy rainfall continuing across the northern Gulf Coast. The bulk of it's already passed through but flood advisories are still in effect for the western Kenai Peninsula. Uh, some rainfall there has totaled anywhere from 4 to 5 inches in the last 24 hours there. Uh, looks like the flooding will continue to uh, slowly recede. Heaviest rainfall again has ended, but showers will likely persist through tonight with the resurrection and snow rivers having crested earlier this morning. Flooding, of course, will continue, and some of that is over the roadway, so do expect some travel issues if you're heading through the Seward area anytime soon. Watch for low pressure to continue to sit very close to Bristol Bay, 994 millibars there with a steady south flow across south central and into the northern and eastern sections of the Gulf Coast. High pressure sitting just off the coast of the Pacific Northwest, uh, sending a decent flow of southerly winds right into the northern Gulf Coast. And that, of course, is keeping this atmospheric river pointed right at uh, parts of northern and uh, the northern Gulf Coast and the northern sections of southeast. It will re-intensify as we head into Thursday there with two more waves working into the Prince William Sound region as parts of southeast. So do plan on more wet weather. Some of that could be substantial. Across the west coast, showers will be persistent there. Areas of light rainfall expected with snow falling across the north slope. With Alaska statewide weather, this is meteorologist.